Kristen and welcome back to 100 Baby, you guys. Today we are here with Gracie and we don't have too much going on today. We have a lot of things around the home that we just kind of need to tend to. And we also do have the new, oh my God. Oh my God, Gracie, what the freaking heck? Okay, yeah, let's just get the bees under control. Oh my gosh, apply some mite treatment. There we go. <laughs> so I also am having Gracie kind of tend to the money tree just to see, oh, can we evolve? Yes. Okay, I don't think we can evolve this one up yet. And no, okay, so we're just kind of taking care of all of the plants and everything that's around here. Now, we did just give birth, you guys, to two freaking vampire babies. So we have Kendall, oh gosh, I can't believe I was just gonna say where are we? We have Randall and Riker in here that we did just have. Now, these are actually the babies of Gracie and Vlad. So they are vampires. I'm definitely freaking nervous about it. And I actually learned something when I was going through the family tree. So if we go over, you guys can see all of the children here that Gracie has had. And oh my gosh, look, every single one of Gracie's brothers and sisters has passed away, you guys. It's actually really freaking sad. Like everybody is gone. Now, if we go over to the new babies, Riker and Randall, you can see um, it's with Gracie and Vlad, but they actually have two uh, um, siblings. They have a half brother, Valentine Strad, and we also have Kira Fries. So this is a half sister, a half brother, and both of their parents are dead, which definitely makes sense because Vlad's a vampire. And he lives forever in, um, oh my gosh, I wonder if they're vampires as well. Oh my gosh. Okay, I feel like we need to have them when they become either like children or teens. I feel like they really need to go out of their way to become friends with their brother and sister because I really want to learn more about them. Um, I read online, okay, let's leave that. Oh my gosh, Gracie's doing so freaking well. So because it is only Sunday, you guys, the only thing right now that we have going on is the babies are going to be aging up. So I actually am looking forward to that. We are going to have Queenie and Quinn get working on everything that they're going to need to get promoted at school. But, oh my gosh, wait, is that our pizza? Oh no, we ordered a pizza the other day and dang it. Okay, so I think what we're going to do is host an event because it is the weekend and Gracie might actually be able to become pregnant today. That's kind of what I am going to be aiming towards. So we are actually going to be inviting over. Let's invite over. Oh my gosh, where Emmanuel. So we actually were working on a new relationship with Emmanuel as well as Hunter, Quentin, and... I think that's all we'll work on just so, okay, we're gonna invite over some of the children. Let's invite back Nellie Harper. Let's invite over, um, Penelope was just here. So let's invite over Haley, Nicole. I said that weird. <laughs> Molly and Mason, let's have them come over. Oh, we have, okay. Let's invite all of them over. Gracie, because we are so rich, we can actually hire a mixologist. And let's go over and make a drink. What do we want to do? I want something that looks really fun. Oh my gosh. Plasma Jane. Buffalo wing. Let's do zebra fizz. Let's make up something to eat. Gracie, you're also going to need to change your... Oh my gosh. Uh, let's just... Um, wow, Gracie, you really need to... Oh, we can put this one on. It's springtime. We can go in our shorts. And let's have the girls come out. Um, tell a group story. We'll tell a fairy tale to Quinn. And let's light this. Get that going. We can even like roast some marshmallows. Holly is wondering if I want to come over. Holly, we can't because we are hosting a little backyard event. And I also think we will have Gracie. Dang it, I kind of wish that we had some teens that could help us with brew. Wait a minute. Sadness? You... Wow, I did not know you can brew herbal remedies on the grill. We'll do grilled chicken. We'll get that going. We have the fire going. Oh my gosh. Okay, everybody is here. Where is Emmanuel? Okay, there he is. Now, just to make sure, I'm also going to be updating the family tree. So if that is something you guys are interested in learning about, 
I do post all of this stuff, you guys, over in the Discord group, over where all of the, um, in the 100 Baby channel. Okay, so we have Erwin, Riker is through, Vlad. Okay, yes, yeah, so we have not had a baby. Quinn, okay, that's good. All right, so we have a bunch of new neighbors. If you guys did happen to miss out on one of the last episodes, we actually moved in a bunch of your Sims next door. And you also can continue, you guys, to add them in because it's 100, baby. So we are definitely going to be needing tons and tons of... Um, I'm going to put that off, actually. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to worry about it. Maybe we... Did we have bills? I never know where to look for bills, but I don't think we have any which is good. Oh my gosh. I thought, okay. Uh, Ness, Twill, you are an adult and you are looking pretty cute. I think we're going to have Gracie get to know. Let's do a funny introduction. Wait, it's Riker's birthday. So we can actually go in and age them up. Finally. Okay. Let's do that. We have an alien over here. That's fine. Okay. Let's get the girls to roast. We'll do marshmallows. You can come over and we can tell a group story. Yeah, how about Nicole? Okay, so Gracie, you are gonna come in. We finally have the notification. We are gonna have some toddlers in here. So let's go in. We're first gonna age up. Little Riker, oh my God. I cannot wait to see what they look like. This is Vlad's children. So, um, we definitely need to, as we age them up, kind of keep them within that vampire kind of theme just to kind of have fun with it. And another good thing is Gracie actually was able to improve a lot of her vampire knowledge when we did have Casper and Ken. So we definitely do need to make sure that Riker and Randall are kind of like getting, wait, why are we so sad? Oh, from a sibling. Oh, Vlad. Oh. <gasps> Oh my God, I can kind of see his hair. Okay, so we're gonna need to pick a tray. As always, we are gonna be using Siri for this. So, hey Siri, pick a number between one and eight. A random number between one and eight is four. One, two, three, four. Ooh, Riker is a charmer. Oh my God, and he has white hair. How perfect is that? Oh my gosh. Our little vampire baby has white hair. I love that. We are going to go into create a sim, I think. And let's go over and we are going to be aging up Randall. I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, so Randall, we need to pick a new trait for you. Hey, Siri, pick a number between one and eight. Hey, Siri, pick a number between one and eight. A random number between one and eight is five. One, two, three, four, five. Independent, thank God. <laughs> That's definitely gonna freaking come in handy for potty training. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I have never seen a toddler be born with turquoise hair. Look at the chin. Oh, no. He looks so much like his father. He was born looking like an 80-year-old. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. It's it's really, um, it really shows how much he looks like his father. Wow. <laughs> they both have Vlad's chin. Oh, my God. I am so sorry, you guys. Look. Wow. They look so much like their father. I can't get over it. Oh, my gosh. So, we are definitely going to be doing some makeovers. Um, in the next episode, I will be giving them some makeovers. Oh my gosh. Actually, I think I kind of want to go and can we modify? Yeah, let's just quickly do this. I know that I always end up putting this at the end of the episode, but um, I'm just going to like quickly do this. So we have, so we can get a little bit of a closer look. Randall, I mean, he is cute, right? You guys, I think I'm going to keep the um, teal hair to be honest. I don't hate it. And it's definitely different in his eyes. Oh my gosh. Okay, can we change the color of his eyebrows? I don't think we can. No, that's fine. 
Not completely loving the top. I might have to actually, you guys, go and see if we can find something more like vampire-y. I think we'll do the cow plant. That's a little bit morbid, I guess. <laughs> and we'll keep him like this for now. I'm gonna get a picture of him. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. And then we have little Riker. Now, Riker looks a little bit evil, not gonna lie, those eyebrows just scream freaking Vlad. Like, look at him, he looks so angry. Definitely not a typical 100 baby um, child, that's for sure. So let's just give him some eyelashes. Oh, that hair. I think he definitely needs something a little bit harsher as well <laughs> for his shirt. So let's just quickly do that. Now, you guys need to let me know if you prefer me to kind of keep this in the episode or if you prefer me to do it kind of like sped up at the end just so that I know, and let's do, oh, there's alien, a future cube. I don't know, we could do a ghost for now. We might come back in eventually and like change this up. I think that'll work. I don't like the shoes though. <laughs> let's just quickly change those. Okay, that'll work. I mean, it's not my favorite look, I'll definitely say that, but I do like going into Create a Sim. I think that's something that we might do once we do age them up, just because I feel like you can get a little bit closer up, like a little bit where you can see every detail about them. And you guys, they are definitely taking after Vlad. Oh my gosh. It's so funny because I feel like the majority of our children take after their mother, but... Oh my gosh. Okay, we need to have Gracie now that the kids are aged up. Where is Emmanuel? Um, here he is. Okay, we really need to have him go inside. Let's call him over because you guys, we need to get him in where the romantic incense is just because, oh my God, what are you doing? Stop making a mess. There's so much stuff to do out here. Why would you do that? Oh my gosh, go swinging with your sister. Ask to swing with Queenie. Emmanuel's coming in. Okay, Gracie, we need to get these incense going. So let's put on some romantic sandalwood. Come on in here and Gracie, you come. Oh, oh, he's going to the bedroom. Okay, let's put this on romantic. And let's get him to... Oh my gosh, where'd he go? Make a flirtatious joke. Gracie is still sad, unfortunately. Wait, Emmanuel, where are you going? Oh, we need to light it in here. <laughs> we have them everywhere, you guys. We do everything in our power. Okay, he smelled it. He loved it. Is he, a, is he an alien? I feel like his voice was a little bit higher than normal. Okay, romance. Let's flirt with him a little bit. I actually can't remember um, how much we did get with him for like romance. Okay, we're gonna not worry about holiday. New skill day, yeah, we really don't need to worry that much about it. Gracie, is she coming in? Okay, there she goes. And I'm gonna randomize this while we're waiting for her to come in. I wanna see a better picture of the toddlers. We're missing one of the children, randomized pose. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Molly, she is so pretty, you guys. Okay, so let's see. He is feeling flirty. Let's kiss his hands. Gracie, oh my gosh, you guys. I would completely freaking be so excited if she ended up getting pregnant by Emmanuel today. Let's go over. Can we do, we're gonna flirt again. We need to make sure that we keep, oh gosh. um, It's still going and it's still over there, okay. Everybody is leaving, so we really need to get this going a little bit quicker. Let's give him a rose. Emmanuel, do you like roses? I kind of want to plant a rose bush so we can have like our own homegrown roses. <laughs> he loves it. Oh my gosh. Okay, he is feeling really flirty. We are making him melt. Flirt once again. Oh my gosh, Gracie, do you really have to pee? This is not the time to go pee. We need to have our first kiss, blow a kiss. Oh my gosh, wait, there it was. Bromance, first kiss, oh my gosh, okay. This is perfect because whenever we have the first kiss, it's not that far behind. Um, <gasps> wait a minute. Gracie, what the heck? 
I was like, wait a minute. It looks like she has a baby okay. belly. And that is because, um, oh my gosh, she is pregnant. We are in the second trimester. How in the world did I forget about that? Crazy. If you guys follow me on Twitter, you guys, I completely have an excuse for this. It has been absolutely crazy, like in real life here <laughs> for me. And I must have just completely forget about it. I wonder, we must have had a baby. We must have already had a baby with a manual. Or maybe he is, I'm going to have to like go back and look, you guys. Wow. <laughs> I can't believe as obsessed I am with Gracie that I would have completely forgot about that. Okay, Gracie, come over and use the bathroom before you pee. All right, so Gracie, we need to double check. I thought I checked that before we did anything. So Gracie is going to be in her second trimester in four hours. So... I mean, at least we were able to get um, the babies aged up. What are you guys doing? Okay, so let's go over. How many of you guys seen the last episode and this whole entire time you are screaming at the screen? Kristen, she's already pregnant. <laughs> oh my gosh. I guess she can't do it all perfectly. Hunter, we are going to... Oh my gosh, wait. No, I think it was Hunter. I feel like the baby was with Hunter. That's definitely who I am thinking. Let me just kind of go over in our relationships. Where is he? Yeah, I kind of, now that I'm thinking about it, because I was obsessed with his tattoos, I'm pretty sure that's who we ended up getting pregnant by. And in the next episode, when we do have the baby, I think we will be able to focus with Emmanuel. So it's not a complete waste because we definitely needed to have Gracie get working on that with another like lover or possibly a few more. And let's just kind of peek on Gracie. So she is going to be an elder in 15 days. We still have 15 days to um, have her have like a few more babies, which is good. You guys, how many more pregnancies do you think she is going to be able to get through? Okay, we have our skills up. We have our homework done. Do we have any extra credit that we can do? No, but we should probably clean this up because there was absolutely no freaking need of that. Quinn, oh, wow, we have a bowl of peas. Okay, what about your schooling? We have that completed. All right, maybe we will have you come over here and go on the pirate ship. And you guys, I think that is where we are going to be wrapping up today's episode. We actually was able to get a lot done. We have Gracie, who is now working on her next relationship um, completely by accident, but it was definitely needed anyways. <laughs> and yeah, so we do have Gracie, who is almost in her second trimester. We also have lined up the next baby daddy or donor, and we also have aged up our vampire babies. I cannot wait to see what they look like as children. So we do need to probably do a little bit of CC shopping. If you guys have any toddler and children vampire outfits that you think it would look adorable on them, definitely link it over in Discord or tag me on Twitter. And um, oh my gosh, we are definitely gonna be needing some baby names for Gracie's upcoming baby that she will be having hopefully in the next episode. So if you guys did enjoy today's completely uh, full of mess um, episode, <laughs> make sure that you guys do give this a very big thumbs up. And oh, do we get any bills? Thank God, no, no bills. Anyways, you guys, that is everything. And hopefully I will see you all next time. Bye guys.